We'll have the latest from Washington in just a moment, but we begin in Cherokee County tonight where police responded to a shooting at a home on Butterworth Road. Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Russ Spencer. I'm Christine Spiro. One man is dead, another in the hospital clinging to life. Fox 5's Denise Dillon tells us what happened. This really is a horribly sad situation. It has so many around here upset and wondering what went wrong inside a home just down this road. Our deputies were dispatched to a person shot call on Butterworth Road. Uh, my husband was on his way back to the house and he saw lots of officers and crime scene tape and then um, canopy set up everywhere. It was late morning. A stretch of Butterworth Road was shut down. Schools in the area were put on a code yellow neighbors were concerned. I don't think anybody really knew what was going on. Um, and so that was just kind of the worrisome. The first deputies on the scene knew something had gone horribly wrong. Uh, when they arrived at the location, they found a deceased male in the driveway who had been shot. Investigators began to look for the shooter. That's when they made another discovery behind the house. They found another person behind the home who also had been shot, uh, and, and there was a weapon with that individual. They believe that he is the shooter. Investigators believe that man had shot himself. Medics rushed him to Wellstar Kennestone Hospital with life-threatening injuries. The sheriff's office is not releasing the names of the two people who were shot, but say they are related. Those worried neighbors are now thinking and praying for the family who lives here. All we can do is just pray for them and the family you know, and hope that they can get through this. And Sheriff's officials say while they're not looking for anyone else who may have been involved in this shooting, this is still considered an active investigation. In Cherokee County, Denise Dillon, Fox 5 News.